Hello, collective. Welcome back to the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. You are greatly appreciated. Uh, there's someone out here living in remorse. Uh, someone may be feeling rejected, isolated. Someone may be feeling embarrassed because of something they invested in when it comes to you. Um, maybe this is someone that may want to reach out to you um, and see if they can sail under karma waters as far as has, have closure with you. There may be a group out here that's been celebrating the fact that they were able to cause some type of stagnation, some type of blockage, and uh, like they're able to control or keep something uh, that does not belong to them and maybe they don't know that whoever they're trying to deceive has awareness of what it is that's going on um, but there's something that's going to be balanced out I don't even think these people realize or know what it is that's about to hit them these are people that are celebrating not knowing like there's a tower right at the end right at the turn right around the corner for them uh so they are happy because they were able to block two people from coming together they are uh, whether this is two people coming together to work together love or whatever with the twin flame the two cup two of cups are here this could have to do with a relationship it could also have to do with a business you two coming together and manifesting some type of abundance together as far as like new new uh idea uh innovations things like that um but these two have been celebrating the fact that they were able to stop youtube from coming together they've been able to keep a masculine from being able to come towards you so this could be your emperor that wants to come towards you but every time he tries to take the initiative to come towards you there are people causing a lot of manipulations and havoc behind the scenes so that you and him do not uh connect but this man is very determined this could be someone that's in the public eye is determined to have this new beginning and he's going to come up with a crafty way um to get away from these people and make sure that you two do connect this man said he's not giving up whoever you're you are that he wants to be with this is someone that's very disciplined okay he is not giving up he's going to get to you when he's supposed to uh it may seem like there's some type of barrier right now but this is not a barrier this is uh something that's playing out uh like it's supposed to um and while this is going out going on like this Excuse me, I had to take my sweater off. It's very hot in my room. Um, while this is going on, uh, all this triggery, stagnation, conflict, com uh, confusion is taking place. Um, this is building character. This is going to help him also build some type of endurance that maybe he's never had before. Or if he has endurance, this is going to help uh, him take that endurance to another level. So this is not really the time to give up. And I don't think this man is giving up. Someone is very determined. Someone is going to find a way to get to you is what I'm hearing. You two will connect, okay? And we'll be very fruitful together. There's a queen of wands possibly in the background of this man that's very determined to receive something that's not hers. There's a whole family fighting behind the scenes because the emperor wants to balance things out with you, wants to give to you. And again, this man is very disciplined, I'm telling you. Uh, someone is not letting up. So I don't know what it is these people think they're doing, but he's not letting up. When the time comes... Uh, because whoever I'm picking up on as this emperor, he's a thinker. Someone is very clever. Someone is very uh, um, intelligent. A little too far ahead of these people. They don't realize it. Uh, he may just be going along with their shenanigans. Um, maybe he feels trapped or right now, whatever they're trying to give him, he's not accepting. So what I'm also picking up on is he could be in a community with a group of people that are trying to keep him in his lower energy. So this is like, if he likes, let's say he likes to drink Guinness, uh, beer or whatever. Now, listen, I am not a alcoholic person. <laughs> I can't tell you much. Maybe <laughs> the, the, the most I know is like the St. James wines, wine, <laughs> wine. <laughs> Uh, if that's it, this is someone likes to drink, all right? And I'm not promoting that on my platform. You know, I'm not judging as well. Do whatever works for you. Um, let's say this is someone that likes to do, likes those, you know, beverages and things like that. What they're trying to do is keep him in his lower energy. So they're going to be providing him more uh, of those beverages. If he's someone that likes to have multiple options and things like that, they're going to start providing him with a lot of options. You may have women showing up in places uh, to surprise him, you know, maybe with a some sum, you know what I mean? Menage twice and things like that. Uh, trying to just keep him in his lower energy so that he does not self actualize and be able to move on and elevate like he's supposed to. Uh, because someone may be financially stable or something like that, but the kind of stable they have right now is conditional, I believe. Um, he's not really fulfilled, he feels trapped in his life. 
uh, he maybe have achieved some type of emotional balance where he's learned how to control his emotions and things like that. Um, but he may still be having a hard time seeing straight, seeing things for what it is or seeing people for who exactly they are. Maybe this is what he was in the past and he's going through some type of, um, uh, change. Um, but there's something where this man is saying, I'm still going to get to this person. I'm not giving up. So he's not giving up. So nobody, uh, can really tell him or stop him. From coming towards you something may happen and i think i have an idea because it's a card that's been showing up a lot and i'm not going to say what that card is but i feel like i have an idea of when a masculine is going to be coming towards a feminine energy and it's not going to be as far as away as you think because you could be someone out here that's ready to love and move on with your life maybe you've lived a single life for a long time and you've had enough of it or whatever and i'm just being direct and straightforward with a lot of you a lot of like empress energies we tend to stay single until we are in a relationship that's worth our time if it's not worth our time we don't got time to entertain friends or benefits and things like that when we were younger maybe we did things like that but when you get to a certain age you just don't have time for things like that so you could be an empress energy that's been single for a long time and really now you're ready to entertain someone or maybe you're willing to partner up with someone in business maybe you've been working by yourself for a long time and now it's time to partner up with someone um, and he wants to partner up with you as well, but there are people behind the scenes trying to stop him, but he's going to be moving on. It's going to have these people trapped in their minds, confused all over the place. It's like, how did he manage to get away from us? How did she manage to get away from us? We've done everything to manipulate him and keep him from moving forward in victory to this person. And here it is. This queen of swords is out here telling the truth. Uh, bringing clarity into a situation, giving him all of the clues that he needs. So someone could be watching you as well. If you're on, on a platform, you could work with this masculine. You don't know. I don't know. But someone is aware of you. Maybe you're advocating uh, now. There could be a queen of swords. Why, why did I say advocating now? You could be telling your truth, living in your truth, whatever it is. There could be a queen of swords behind the scenes um, that may have gone through some type of change. Maybe she's advocating for you not to receive what it is that belongs to you so that you can move on with your life. Maybe someone had a misconception about who you were in the past. Maybe they didn't know something was not what it was. Um, but there's some type of scenario that is playing out that's going to turn out in your favor. Uh, be cautious with certain energies trying to come towards you. You have some type of connection with you these are all people that made the decisions to go up against you to block your finances block your comfort your independence block everything uh just block your light they don't want you being happy they don't want you being content they don't want you being humble they don't want you being seen as someone that's of uh, of substance um they don't want you being a choice so there's something where a group has been doing something behind the scenes to make sure that you don't receive or be seen as a choice for someone so that you don't move forward but there's clarity out here the truth is being illuminated to whoever needs to see it so for example this will be the, the group of friends that got together to block or stop some type of relationship from coming together they'll like maybe if you're on like a platform they'll get together figure out some type of way to block you from being seen or heard but it's that there's only one person that really needs to see and hear you so that they can know the truth and that person already knows it and they have access and everything you i mean you they they have a cell phone so they can just get on there and watch you just like everybody else so basically, at the end of the day, all the maliciousness these people have been doing to block your resources, your income, and things like that, it's all in vain because someone knows exactly where you are. They know where to find you and things like that. It's just in due time. But yeah, the truth is out. The truth is out. Like something is being balanced out. Truth, clarity, everything is out here. Okay? We got that ace of source, which means there's clarity about what someone was doing, a, a, friend, a friend group, toxic friend group were doing, trying to steal someone options steal someone's relationships steal someone's money steal someone's house property whatever it is your energy your, your your joy your vibe your essence they've been out here trying to steal everything just everything someone may be even confessing to an energy maybe a leader or someone or a man of high honor a woman of high honor someone may be confessing to him about everything they everything they all invested in when it came to causing you blockages uh, blocking you from being able to work, receive opportunities and things like that. People lying on you, defaming you, all kinds of stuff. Someone is confessing the truth, okay? 
and you may not even know it. Uh, could be a queen of swords that's confessing the truth, and this is bringing balance. I'm telling you, you two will be connecting. There's nothing these people can do to block you two from connecting. This is a union that is like a soul contract. So you two have been together multiple other lifetimes. More than likely, you incarnate almost every lifetime and do this whole scenario over again until you can build character and your souls can ascend. And as you can see, started at two, S2, got together and became one. Okay, you see that right there? So it's going to be happening. You two may end up getting married. You will get end up getting married, not me. You will end up getting married. The two shall get together and become one. That's what we see right here. Okay. Um, so I don't know what it is these people are doing, but they're very ambitious. We got to give them A for effort. Um, but as far as execution, the universe says it's a god dang no. The universe is stepping up. Your ancestors are protecting you. Whoever this masculine is, is protecting himself as well, standing his ground, maybe advocating for you. This is someone who has... Uh, you know, gone through some type of change. His character is being like uh, molded into something new and better, right? Going through some type of ascension. So this is someone that could have been in his lower energy before, but he's now doing the right thing. And he has found discipline or has built the discipline to make it through this story, this situation, whatever karmic cycle this is, these people have initiated for themselves. Um, but you know, when people are dark and they're distorted, Oftentimes, they'll believe that whatever chaos they're causing, they're causing it for you. Not knowing in the end what they're really doing is causing chaos for themselves and causing themselves ending endings. Because I see a group of people that are about to lose. I'm telling you, they're about to lose their jobs. They're about to be out here just trapped. They've been committed to nothing but causing conflict and chaos. A group of people that have no business even doing something, but it's the bitterness and wickedness for me. This is all I see when these people come out in these streets. It's a lot of bitterness, a lot of anger, a lot of hate uh, geared towards someone that has done nothing to these people. You'll be surprised you meet some of these people. You don't even know them. You, they're talking to you or talking about you like they know you and you're just like, who the heck are you? Like, I don't even know you from Adam. The heck you got problems with me and I don't know you. Make it make sense, okay? But they're working really hard to keep you stuck or keep him stuck, keep him trapped so that he does not have this new beginning in love with a lot of offers when it comes to, uh, you know, careers, business, and things like that. Like you two are supposed to build a little, uh, not a little, a huge business empire or just an empire or together. You, the Queen of Cups, they're trying to block you from receiving this six of pentacles. So this is someone coming in to invest in whatever it is that you are working on. Yeah, they're they're, they're finding a way out on how to, figuring out how to balance this situation out. It will be. He went from here thinking about it, trying to figure it out. What do I do? What do I do? Then right here, right? It's been balanced out his destiny. And he figured out what to do. And this, he, there he goes taking action. Nobody knows how, what kind of action he's going to take. And if I find out, I mean, I feel like I have an idea, but I'm not going to say it in here. But this man knows the truth. This is a whole emperor with an intuition, too. And he knows deep down that these people have been trying to defeat, stop, block two people from coming together. And this is why he has amped up his determination, his discipline to get to his destination. And he will. And him getting there is going to leave a lot of people in hot water. Um, this man could also be out here very much disappointed in himself because what I'm picking up on picking up on is that some of you this could be someone that took some type of action was very dedicated to blocking you, causing you heartbreak, loss, and things like that. So there's some type of closure you two are going to have. Yeah, he was very determined. Listen, my ancestors, y'all know they'd be one-on-one. -on -one. They'd be one here. Like we, we got married a long time ago, and we, we, we operate as one. I don't even have a soul guy anymore. Like, I am my soul guy. We've merged together. We are one. Okay, you see me? See my soul guy. See my soul guy? See me. Okay? But... Whoever your higher level soulmate is or whoever this is was working very hard behind the scenes for a long time because this is a tower and the Ten of Wands. This is someone that was working very hard and for a long time to cause you a lot of losses. And now that the truth is out that maybe you're not this person's enemy, that you didn't do anything to this person. You're not someone that's malicious. You're not someone that operates from your lower energy. It has him burdened. Because he's realizing he's been going up against his own twin. 
soulmate, whatever we want to call it. He said, God dang, you may have been going after mine, my partner, my soulmate, my soon to be. It was about to come out. Yeah, and now he's taking actions to balance this sucker out, taking a new direction, going within, having some type of introspection. Someone may have gone to seek some type of advice from a, a sage, uh, maybe a, 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 a practitioner, maybe a professional, and maybe they've helped him figure something out. He's been able to go in and see things for what it is they are. Someone may be keeping away from a group of people because he sees them for the nonsense that they are. So he may be taking action now. On his passion, he said, he said, that's my passion right there. That's where I want to be. That's where I want to be. This could be someone very high ranking. And there are people fighting behind the scenes to block good karma from playing out in your life. But the universe said it got me effed up in one in too many ways. I am going to make sure that this takes place. So whoever is coming towards you, they're leaving that institution to come and invest in you or YouTube's future. Yeah, they're coming to invest Okay, you're a blessing to this person and they're a blessing to you. Someone, I don't think they realized when they met you that you were a blessing to them. But now that they know, here they come. They say, I want to I work with you. I want to invest in what it is you have going on. I want to invest into you. I want to work with you. Whatever he's coming to say, it's going to be different for a lot of you. Some of you, it's work. Some of you, it's relationship, business, whatever. Uh, but he's planning on giving you some type of opportunity that's going to put you out there. And people are going to love what it is that you do. Uh, people are going to love what you got to say and things like that um okay someone has a lot of emotions for you with this devil followed by the ace of cups man someone has a lot of feelings for you like if this person comes towards you and you turn them down they'll never be able to recover from this is what i'm hearing so someone has a lot of passion for you a lot of love a lot of desires and things like that and it may even scare them a little bit because they've never been like this with anyone or over anyone like someone may be very protective of you not that the truth is out they're not playing any games about you they want you to know that they are here for you and guess what came after the card the, the ace of cups is the eight of pentacles so this is someone that is committed to this union coming together and i don't know what this is it could be both love and pentacles since we have both of those out here but this person has a lot of desires for you and knows the truth someone is going through some type of awakening and separating himself from a karmic community karmic group and he's seeing the truth um, yeah, but what has really been going on? There could be a couple that's, I don't know what, I'm, I'm not even going to. There could be a couple going through something, about to go through something, whatever this is. We're going to leave it at that. Um, there's a queen of wands that may be trying to give this man an offer. He's not accepting it. She could be, as she could have been expecting an offer to go to her, but he knows the truth about what she's been doing. And maybe she didn't know he knew the truth or didn't know a community knew the truth. And there's an offer that's not going to her. They may have tried to take some type of offer from you to give it to one of their own, one of their kind, and it didn't, it didn't pan out the way they thought it would because someone knows the truth about who has been investing in something. So if it's your business, he knows that you're the one that's the creator, the innovator of that business. So they can come in and say, hey, yeah, we were the one that created this. She's been stealing from us. He's been stealing from us. And he's going to be like, uh, you got got me effed up in one and too many ways with the fact that you think you can come in my office in my home and insult my intelligence i know exactly who that belongs to and you ain't getting a dime from me something like that and he's moving on with that said leaving them trapped in their minds leaving them as confused as this all as this as this always why can't i talk they don't want me saying the truth He's going to be leaving them as confused as they've always been going through a tower. And what they're really trying to do is stop you from receiving your this six of pentacles. Like there's some type of truth going on about how a group, a community has been working together to make sure that they receive some type of financial payout. You don't receive it. This man said, you got me after I'm out. You ain't receiving a dime. Going right to that Queen of Cups, balancing this sucker out. About to be out here, figuring and balancing things out. And endless opportunities together, working together. Could be a King of Wands that's seeing you as wish fulfillment. Hoping that you will forgive him and will know that he's trying to support you or something like that. I don't know, but 
uh, he's trying, he's hoping that you'll forgive him for taking action to betray you is what I'm picking up on. Um, uh, because yeah, this is what I've been picking up on is that this man here for some of you may have taken some type of action to betray you with a queen of wands or queen of cups reverse, or it could be the both of them and then some. Okay. Um, but he will be coming towards you to give you some type of offer of friendship, whoever you are. And he's maybe disappointed that he worked with this karmic group and this Queen of Wands reversed in the past against you. And he may be pissed off because the truth is out. Someone may have confessed to him that they've been blocking him from connecting with who it is he's supposed to be with. They've been purposefully causing hindrances and he may be pissed off about that. I don't know if someone was going trying to get, uh, get some like even the score with him maybe he did something to someone and it pissed them off and he went ahead and whoever this is went ahead and did the same thing same thing to him or this would just be a feminine energy a group of people that are just malicious for no reason okay they themselves are planning on taking some type of reckless action just throw with caution sir if you're still around these people i don't know what is wrong with these people but they're very angry they're very angry that you um are not listening to them you're not trying to stay with them the fact that you're choosing to heal the fact that you are awakening they're very angry about this okay the fact that you want to have a new beginning somewhere else because they told you whoever it is you are interested in it's not worth your time they've been de deceiving you and causing conflict for a long time with you for you and to you and you've been going along with it they said what the heck is going on now when did he wake up he should be asleep um, but someone woke up the bear and now the bear is like, mm, yeah, I'm not sleepy. It's not time for hibernation yet. Okay. Uh, so there's a truth out about some type of relationship as well that did not take place. Also, there's something about how you did not re receive the fruits of your labor because the seven of pentacles has to do with you putting in time, effort, and energy, even resources into something you're very, uh, uh, um, uh, um, uh, passionate about, excuse me, you put in the time, you put in the effort, the resources that you needed to, when you were supposed to receive your, your, uh, your fruits, uh, huh. Someone did something to make sure that you didn't receive it, right? They, they, they had you left out in the cold. Uh, so if you invested and you were supposed to receive some type of return on investment, they did something to steal that from you. They said, nah, you can't have that. They're not worth that. They don't need to have all that money because apparently these are the people that have authority. So they believe that they, they are in, they have a place to decide who can have what and who cannot have what. And the universe is about to humble these people. But whoever this is knows, okay? They know, absolutely knows. And the group by this point may even know that you two will be coming together. Let's look at that. Three of Wands, Higher Fence, Six of Cups. You two will be coming together may end up getting married or just working successfully together okay and it's going to be some type of relationship that's very traditional um what i'm also hearing about is that this group this group whatever this is they're very like-minded not in a healthy way but very like-minded very like-minded and it's really kind of scary the karmic side of the group and they're going through some type of karma Man. Yeah, but this man, this man, whoever this is, I'm picking up on, he's determined. And I say this man is determined on having victory. I'm telling you, he's determined on having victory. Uh, he's determined to get out of this institution. And I don't know where he's going because I see the Eight of Cups laying down here. But he's going somewhere to get to someone and it's going to put an end to this. I don't know who these people are. But they're about to be going through it. Um, I will also throw with caution with this person, though, that's coming towards you. There's some type of ambition or intention. I don't know if someone's coming towards you yet so they can have some type of hand in what it is that you do. Uh, so it could be that someone wants to balance something out with you so they can have a hand in your Ten of Pentacles. Um, because they know whatever it is you do is something that's meant to be very abundant, something that's very um worthwhile like this is like a ten of pentacles energy and you know this is like legacy you can build multiple uh avenues out of it uh so this is something that's going to be around for a long time so this masculine maybe want to come towards you to give to you just so that he can have some type of attachment to it as well and i'm just saying that because it's been given to me 
that download is being given to me. Uh, also, what I'm hearing, he may end up paying the Queen of Wands. Also, go away. Like, just go away. Like, he may be sick and tired of someone. And he may give them some type of money to just go away. Like, he does not want to be bothered with this woman. They say, here you go. Here's $50,000. Do whatever it is you want to do with it. Go away. I don't want to be with you. I don't want to work with you. I don't want to be associated with you. I didn't know this is what you were about. Or I don't want to be part of this anymore. I, I, I'm trying to do something different now. Whatever the situation is, he said, go away, basically. It's how he's... That basically that's what he's doing. He may not say it that way. Now you all y'all know me. I'll be coming here and I just say what it is. But basically what it is he's doing while giving her that money is that go away. I'm like shoe fly, don't bother me. Basically, kind of energy. <laughs> he said, I'm trying to take a new path in life, take a new direction. I don't got time to be going through this nonsense with you. You're out here a grown woman that refuses to heal. And this is what she's afraid of. This communication coming to you, knowing the truth that maybe he's determined. She knows that like, he's determined to get to that Queen of Cups and give her that offer. And there's a Queen of Cups that's been out here paying other people to cause someone else an ending of blockages, heartbreaks, and things like that. Like, very malicious. Like, they want to keep a King of Wands trapped. They could, you know, the King of Wands, with what I'm picking up, since the King of Wands are people that typically tend to be very good looking, like very handsome, charismatic, and things like that, and then they tend to be business leaders or very successful in life and things like that, if they, if they uh, um, transmute that energy the right way. So this could be someone that's very good looking, has money, uh, maybe a good body, a nice size wand or whatever this is, and it has these women obsessed. Lord, have mercy. Have mercy. These people don't, these women don't know what to do with themselves out here. It said he got everything. He checks all the boxes. Nice, nice size one. Uh, a good bank account. Um, uh, we've kept him toxic for years. He cannot awaken. Uh, we're able to manipulate him. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're gonna have to keep him. We're gonna have to keep him. Do everything you can to keep him trapped. And he awaken. He said, "Sure, uh, uh, you got me effed up. <laughs> I'm out." <laughs> he made a decision to get out. He said, what, what is this sign? The higher, yeah, 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 yeah. The higher fin. Let me do the higher fin. He said, I'm out. <laughs> the decision. As above, so below. I said, I'm out. In the spirit, I've left you. And now in the physical, I'm out. <laughs> right into victory to put an end to this nonsense with this queen of wands. That has full knowledge of where he's going. That he knows the truth. That she has been doing a little bit too much, too much. And when it comes to her lying about a queen of a uh, queen of pentacles, um, uh, empress energy, like they are, that man already know. He knows what it is. He knows what it is. Yeah. Yeah. So maybe this this man coming in to give you this friendship, whatever this is, he calls it, it's going to balance things out for you. You may have a group of friends that are choosing to do something, fix something. Maybe there's a group in a community now that knows the truth. They know you're in the upright, you're genuine, you're sincere, you're someone that's supposed to be worked with, not someone that's supposed to be played with. And they've all been watching you. So they may be taking action to balance something out. They have just display out or something like that. Whatever it is, this could be one sector of the group because what I'm thinking thinking what i'm picking up on is there are two parts of this group one is still karmic one side is still karmic trying to stop you uh stop you two from connecting and the other side is like listen they're supposed to be together work together whatever this is we tired listen come on come on he's here she's here let's bring them together and get this over when we're tired yep we're tired <laughs> they said we want to get back to other things we have other things to pretend to attend to my dog is sick i gotta take my dog to the vet my kids daycare is getting on my nerves uh my kid keep crying i don't know what the heck the, what the f the crying for getting on my last nerve i've missed a lot of hours at work i gotta catch up got bills i'm behind on and he's like, i got stuff to worry about i don't got time you, you don't want them to be together that's your business to worry about but as for us listen johnny you stay here, she stay here. Let's find a way to get you two right here and get this over with. We don't... <laughs> They're choosing to be practical about the situation. Now, all of this had to do with resources and jealousy. They said, why does she and him? 
get to have everything. It's really because of the work people put in spiritually. This man hasn't always been like this, I believe. There's some type of work he's been going through. Because with this Knight of Wands out here, this is someone that more than likely used to be very impulsive and reckless, especially with his wand and his finances, just giving to any and everybody. And they're trying to stop him from moving forward, but he's taking action. It don't matter what it is. But it's like every time this man takes action to try to do something, they're doing something to block him. See that right there to keep him stuck. Keep him from taking action. And he's trying to figure out what it is he can do to balance the situation out. And he will. Um, but it's just, I don't know. Like th th There's something really eerie about this group, this community, whatever it is. It is. People like me, we wouldn't last in these kind of communities because we pick up on everything. So you come to work thinking about poisoning someone or having someone set up maybe we pick up on you in three in point three seconds and you got to go you cannot be around here um but it's something like that something i think it, with that coming out also these people may have a problem with someone's intuition you could be someone that's very practical but also very gifted very talented skill a high priestess because the high priestess has been showing up a lot in these readings so these people could know that you are very, very gifted and talented, may have even been taken from you and acting like it was coming from them, like your downloads. They were trying to steal your downloads and things like that. This is why it's out here in the reverse as well. They were trying to steal your creativity, steal your intuition, steal your love, your, your abundance, the fruits of your labors and things like that. And the truth is out about that. But... They have a problem with how intuitive you are, how gifted you are. Because if you are around this person, you're going to illuminate the truth to them. And they're going to see everybody for who they are in a situation. And someone is going to appreciate it appreciate that about you because these are all people friends uh, that have been working together for a long time stealing from this masculine manipulating him deceiving him just playing mental games with him because this could be someone that's very wealthy okay this could be someone that's very wealthy out here right and they find they figured out how to play with his mental to get things out of him there's another king of pentacles i've been picking up behind the scenes picking up on behind the scenes that's very greedy uh, may not be as successful or financially stable as he once was because he did some type, took some type of reckless business move and partnered up with the wrong people and now he stands to lose everything. Baby, this is just too much for my little pea-sized brain. I got to get up out of this energy. But I'm so glad two people are going to be meeting. The two shall become... The two shall come together and become one. It's what I'm picking up on here. Okay? Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Be I always love a happy ending. Don't y'all love a happy ending when two people can come together after all the rock rats got together and try to cause havoc, try to block two people from communicating, try to block pe two people from having fulfillment, block two people from healing, uh, uh, you know, building together and all kinds of stuff. Is that why you just invested in us? Even Yeah, they're coming together. It ended up on the two of freaking... <laughs> Two of Cups. It said, why are you just invested in us not being together? What is your problem? Again, two of two coming together. The number of manifestation. And then I put it back down and it ended up up, ended up on the six of pen, six. I did do associate the number six with the six of pentacles, and I shouldn't do that. But balance, you silly on the common waters, things like that. Um, but they said, why are you all this? intent on us not coming together we don't want nothing from you at this point you know i don't want you you know i don't want you leave me be what you think i'm about to stay in this community and keep giving to you and i don't even like you you ever heard of anyone doing that they don't like you but they take money to give to you repeatedly nah 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 nah, nah. that man's about to do you a favor miss karmic by giving you that little money it ain't a little bit of money. That's a lot of money. But giving you that money so you can shoe fly go away. Shoe fly don't bother him. It's what he's saying when he does that, by the way. It's not because he's still in love with you or because he wants to be with you. He knows you're financially motivated. He knows all you care about is money. And he knows your brain is so far gone, so dumb down, that you are you don't know when to stop doing something that you should have stopped doing a long time ago. So basically what it is he's doing is giving you some money to... Shut you down. He said, go away. I said, go away. Basically. Okay. Well, anyways, thanks for watching, folks. I'll see you in my next read. Stay blessed and goodbye for now.